Welcome to today's training. The purpose of this video is to explain to you how to use the picture in picture feature while you are inside Zoom. And I'm gonna show you how to use a countdown timer. So here I am in the Chrome Web Store. So do a Google search for Chrome Web Store. And then the name of the extension that you're looking for is picture in picture. Once you get to this location, over here on the right hand side, it says remove from Chrome because I already have it installed. Yours will give you the option of installing. Wait just a few minutes in order for this extension to install into Chrome. Uh, it kind of goes without saying that you should have Chrome open, not Internet Explorer or Firefox. You should be in Google Chrome. And then up here, I have a series of extensions and mine is located right here. If you can't find it, click on the puzzle piece and then you can scoot down. You'll see I have a whole lot of them. If you want it to anchor into this position up here, just click on the push pin right here. And that means that it will pin to this region. You also have the power to move it around wherever you see fit. So you can prioritize them and then put them where you want them. So here's the next step. I'm inside YouTube. I searched for a three minute timer and I used the words school and bell at the end. There are some really great timers out there. Some of them have like um, fire alarm sounds at the end. And I think that the school bell is very indigenous to that whole in-class learning experience. So it is less alarming. If you want this little timer to live on top of near adjacent to your Zoom experience so that you stay on time to each of your different sessions, or you wanna alert the students that it's a good time to transition, well, find this link, a link similar to it. They have a four minute timer, a five minute timer, a 15 minute timer, a 60 minute timer. So choose the one that works best for you and then click the picture in picture button. And this video that was right here is now tucked into the bottom corner. I'm gonna minimize this screen to show you that it's living right there on my desktop because it's the most um, upfront item that I'm working with. And then I can click the play button and then 23 seconds from now, this school bell will go off letting me know that it's time to transition, but also it's a delightful way to let the children know that it's time to transition as well. And then you would need to determine the volume level for the video um, so that uh, the individuals who are listening can hear it well. And there's that bell. I can't promise you that the children will have access to hearing it because normally when we um, share our screens, we would make sure that the sound goes. So that might be a little um, checkbox that you would need to determine. And you might need to select in order for the children to hear it well. But if you need a tool that's keeping you on top of the schedule, that might be a resource worth checking out. All right, team, have a great day.